one's been here. Uh, wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> I don't think so. Or displays. I feel like they're hiding something behind there. are witnessing my first time. Is 
something. All right. Oh, yo, yo. All that other thing, darn it. super light and I don't know let's see yeah because there's like no brains to it if you get what I'm saying Ding, ding, donged it. Mm. It's funny. You know what I need to be doing? I need to be checking the frames here a little more often. Here you go, guys. take everything because uh, I don't like figs but again I'm not the only one that comes here so oh my gosh you guys and if you haven't seen my one video where I scored that big shopping cart uh, that has been like godsend <laughs> um, for loading and unloading things. and stuff but I'm not taking that uh. Uh. all right 
Let's check this last bag. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at this. Lemon snaps. Look at this. The biscottis with lemon. Oh my goodness. When did that... That expired... September. I know, I know, I know. But... Like I said, I'm not the only one that comes through here. So... Leave, leave stuff for them. All right, guys, I'm gonna put this in my car. Okay, guys, I just swung by Bed Bath and Beyond, and I'm finding this Cuisinart. I don't know what's going on. I'm gonna just take it home. Then there's some box of something is in there. Some uh, coffee press, some shower head thing. I don't know. But a bunch of little stuff here. So we'll look at it when we get home. Okay, guys. So this is everything from the Bed Bath & Beyond score. So let's just start. Um, first, this wasn't in my video. Um, I actually found this like a week or so ago. I just forgot to show you guys. But um, it was in a, um, a box, a sealed box. Like it was either mailed back to Bed Bath & Beyond, but after I inspected it and looked it up on Bed Bath & Beyond, this was a uh, pots and pans rack and shelf, and I priced it online, and I think it was like 79 or 89 So I just listed that pots and pan rack for sale. And then this was in my haul here, so I found this cute little dish uh, drying rack, very nice, um, and it has the little uh, handles that can go in and out, depending on how large your kitchen sink is. Then this uh, attachment for your sh uh, shower head, and when I got home, I realized the... Um, this this guy wasn't there, so I went back last night and found it. So I got that part, and I'm gonna hook that up and see if if it works. Um, and then, if you guys saw the Cuisinart, um, I cannot believe this uh, pot. Everything is just perfect. They didn't spray paint it. Um, there are no chips. Nothing is wrong with it. So I have no idea why it was returned, but I did price it online on Amazon, and I think it's around $80 or something like that. But, wow, you guys. I mean, that is just, it's beautiful. And Cuisinart is, you know, one of the top of the line. All right, and then there was this coffee press. Not sure about that, but... I think maybe my girlfriend Jolyn might like that. So Jolyn, if you like it, text me. I'll put that. I will uh, put that in your Christmas box. And then this cute uh, shower caddy. I really like this a lot. It's um, metal, not plastic, and it's really cute. And I need some extra space uh, to put things, so I'm going to use that. All right, and then there was a box, another sealed box in the dumpster. At least I think it was sealed. But I took it home, and it was these cute ramkin bowls. So uh, I couldn't find them on Bed Bath & Beyond website, and then I ended up finding them on Home Depot because the brand is, uh, is Better Homes. And I looked them up, and I think these were going for $22. So I'm going to list those for sale as well. Nothing was wrong with them. I checked them all, and um, nothing was broke, and they didn't spray paint it or break them. So score with that. Then this cute little ex, um, 
it expands, extends for the duster, which I started playing around with it. I really like it. It, um, it ex expands pretty far here. So it's, it's pretty far. And I was playing around, um, with the tops of like my door ledges or like a ceiling fan. So that was kind of cute. I like that. Um, they did do a little spray paint job to that, but I don't care. It's going to go in my closet and it opens up. Um, and there was a little, it was snapped there and that one, but I, I think that I can fix that. But look at you guys. I like this a lot. You can, um, can use it for my scarves or you can use it for belts. So I will definitely get use out of that. Then I found some more of these coffees, and I love you guys for all your comments. Uh, duh, Heather, you could just open up the little thing and make your own a cup of coffee. Um, but, yeah, so that is everything. Oh, oh, nope, that isn't everything. You guys, I'm not sure what is going on here. But this is a hair removal device, and I look this sucker up. And this company is a pretty big deal. They sold over 6 million of these. And it's supposed to be pain-free um, hair removal. And look how much it is. $250. And I priced them used even for sale. And they're going for $200. Um, to be honest, I want to try it. My daughter wants to try it. So we're going to see if this guy works. But... In the dumpster, Bed Bath & Beyond, $250. That is insane. So yeah, guys, this is everything. Another great dumpster score at Bed Bath & Beyond. All right, uh, next I'm going to show you guys my world market uh, snack score. Pretty amazing. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so I peeked over here. I was getting ready to leave and I'm like what is this? oh my gosh you guys what the heck look at oh my gosh we have so many of these at home so I am not about to take all of these but chocolate chunk cookies oh my goodness oh my goodness you guys Ginger beer. Okay. I'm gonna just sell all this Hello Kitty right here. Oh my god, there's another bag of stuff behind it. What the heck? What the heck? Hello Kitty rice. Oh my goodness. I'm not taking all of that. Um, oh my gosh, you guys. This is just crazy. Salted caramels? What the heck? Oh my goodness. I need to get a box. But normally, these dumpsters have one right next to it. And... My cart is just overflowing, guys. Oh my goodness. This is insane. You know what? Let me grab this bag. Okay. All right. someone else comes here and checks this out tonight because there's a lot of stuff. I don't know what these are. Open turmeric. What is this? I don't know what that is. Pepper, salt, something? Oh my goodness. Prime time snack mix. 
That is so crazy, you guys. Oh my goodness. This is just insane. Someone uh, left me a comment because I found a bunch of these at Michael's and they said that you can freeze these. I'm like, I don't even know if I have enough room in my freezer, but... Oh my gosh, you guys, what is back here? that you guys are going to be like, why aren't you taking? But I'm only going to take simply salted flatbread. Goodness. I don't know if I can fit through here. lemonade bottles. Look at this. Alkaline spring water. Cucumber mint. Oh. Look at these pink lemonades. Oh my gosh. Hello kitty. all want to come out. All right, oops. I think I made a, a big mess. Oh. Wow, you guys, what a score. All right, I really hope someone comes and gets this. But my other thing is, I know people donate, but I don't know about donating expired food. So if you guys want to leave a comment down below and tell me your thoughts. But I, uh, I don't know how I feel about that. And I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Again, I know a lot of people come through here and they will get it. All right, guys, on to the next. All right, everyone, here is everything from the World Market uh, dive that I've scored. And here is these delicious little flaky pastry croissant type. I don't know how to describe this, you guys, but it said a puff pastry with a raspberry filling. These are so delish. Um, they, I grabbed a few of those here, as you can see. Um, they are just divine. It's nice, like if you have company coming over, you could put a little bit like on a, a plate and people will just eat these up. They're just so delicate and really good. So if you have a world market, definitely look for those you won't be disappointed um grabbed a couple boxes of crackers then these little mini like moon pies hello kitty so cute then we have these bakehouse chocolate chip cookies here's another one i've never tried bakehouse until recently and these chocolate chip cookies are so good with a Really, really cold glass of milk. That's my, that's my jam, that's for sure. But yeah, these cookies are delish. 
Then next were these dark chocolate salted caramels. And I grabbed some of those. And then these stoop, I think I'm saying this, is it waffles or waffles? But um, again, put these in the freezer. These are can be warmed up, as you can see. Some people put them over a cup of coffee or tea. You can pop them in the microwave and um, they just warm up nicely and uh, they're really, really good as well. Here are these crack, these rice crackers. You guys, these are really, really good. My daughter and I tried one. I've seen these bags before, never purchased them before, but um, they have this nice, like, kind of garlicky seasoned taste, but they're, they're very, very tasty. Um, I wasn't disappointed. Um, next, I love lemon. So these lemon snaps are delicious. Then some pink lemonade um, bottles here. Very good. Then um, they had one box of the coffee. Had the 18 pods in there. And then I forgot to show you guys this in the last clip. But when I had went back over to Bed Bath & Beyond, they were throwing away this adorable bowl. Look at how cute this is. And it even has, let me see, I'll look at the little pumpkin. So cute. The only thing was there was one little chip there. So, I mean, I can use it as a decorative piece or something, but it is... Um, very nice. That was the only little defect. But yeah, guys, this is everything here. Pretty nice score. I did go back the next day because I did this dive on Sunday. I went back on Monday and almost everything was gone. So that makes me feel good that other people went and got the rest of the stuff. So... All right, guys, that is it. That was a great week last week. I will be diving all weekend, so stay tuned. If you guys enjoyed the video, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe and the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. You guys enjoy your weekend and stay tuned.